Let's Play! Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie 2 -E, Wrong Game Blind. That was a failure of an intro if I've ever done one. That is a Cheeto page. I don't know if I can get up there actually right now. And yep! Uh, I have not done much looking for where to go next, so this part may literally just be confusing. Except there's shoes here. What is this? Springy step shoes. Well, you have to come and find me before you can use them. Okay. So that's probably how I get up there. For now, how about we go fast? Because I gotta go fast. And I gotta go fast. Oh my god, these! Right, that, we could probably use it for this. Okay. Well, let's... Let them run out. Run over there, hit that switch. Then we can gotta go fast. There we go, okay. I remember this now, because I got this and then couldn't do it. Then we gotta hurry still. I almost made it last time though, so that's good. This, now I should be definitely able to make it. As long as I can find out where it is. Because I sort of, maybe kind of forget. We can run on water? Dude. That is amazing. And yeah, we're so gonna make this. Oh, that okay, that was kind of cool. I figured that out all on my own. However, this is a waterfall cave. Don't... okay. Oh, I saw a Jiggy! So I did something right. Don't miss that. If I slipped and fell off there, I'd be a sad penguin. But that was awesome, we did it. Okay. Where does that go? Can I reach over there? Let's try. Yes, I did! Whoa, totally awesome, bro! I'm on a roll! And we are... Hello! That actually scared me. Wow! I actually got a good, uh... Good jump! It seems both games have gotten the best of me now. So let's swim. Go in a little tube. As long as nothing jumps out. Or giant mechanical sharks. That's bad. I don't think there's anything up there for air. So let us logically just keep going. Maybe something hiding in here. But I just want to find a, a good spot to rest first, you know. Is there air up here? That is a negatory. So I should hurry. Yeah, that's, that's not good that I'm losing air. Is that... That is air, yes. But where am I now? At a jiggy, is the answer to that previous question. That was two jiggies in three minutes. Wow. Pretty darn awesome. You know, I'm... I don't know, I'm not gonna say I'm doing well this part, because that is how you jinx things. Which is not what I want to do right now at all. I think it was then. Was it left or right? Where am I? Oh goodness. Where's the hole? Where's- this is like my first girlfriend all over again. Where's the hole? There it is. That was a terrible joke and I apologize for it was very, very, very rude. Plus I- I've never- <laughs> I've never gotten that far. Let's be let's be honest here. I mean, I I'll joke and you'll joke, but uh hello. I can't see what's going on in here. Is this where we just were? I can't tell. All I can hear are these guys yo going yeeha. Where am I? So that's nothing. You are an enemy and shall die. Okay, so this isn't the right place. I guess I did just go in a circle. That, or that was where I was, and I can't even see where to go out now, because I, did I walk through darkness at the beginning? It's like a Kingdom Hearts question. Did I walk through the darkness at the beginning, or did I trample through the light near the end? Kingdom Hearts is light. I actually had no time to play Kingdom Hearts because of, um... One Piece. Holy crap, I'm still addicted to One Piece Pyro Warriors 2. There's something about it. There's an actual 
addictive factor to it. Like, very few games have that true addictive factor, and I might just die. Um, but, like, it really does, where I need to play more at times. And I've already beaten story mode. There's, like, not much else for me to do. But there's just, like, there's so many characters. I still have characters to unlock, which... I mean, on the one hand, it kind of sucks when there's characters that it's like... Can I drill all the way down there? Can I go, like, super drill right here? No. Okay. It's like, on the one hand, games that have really hard to unlock characters sucks because you might not ever get to those characters. But on the other hand, it's real incentive to keep playing. So, hey, it depends on how you view life, you know? So here's the water storage again. I don't know of anything in here. Have we gone up there? I don't think we have. And if we did... I probably forgot. Uh, no, we definitely didn't. Is that a Cheeto page, or is that a thingy? That was a Cheeto page. Awesome, I haven't seen Cheeto yet. Actually, I don't like Cheetos. Can I just say something? I really don't. I find them to be, like, the most unattractive of chips. It's like... Doritos, at least, I don't know, there's something kind of elegant in their design. But Cheetos, man, they're just an overall bad time, you know? Where does this go? I'm just looking around at this. Ooh. We have to come back here with, uh, Boomy Boom. Not to be confused with Boomy. Korra's teacher's brother. I was gonna say uncle, but that's not right at all. She's not related to Tenzin. You guys might not know what I'm talking about, and you'll probably be like, What is he talking about? In which case, I will say go watch Legend of Korra right now. It's interesting, though, because in retrospect, it's not as good as Avatar The Last Airbender, which if you haven't seen that, no, no, you need to stop this video right now and go watch it, because it is brilliant. Just in everything. Um, and Korra as a sequel series is different, but in, in both good and bad ways. So take that as you will. I enjoy it. I know certain people, like a certain Ntom64, who just complains about it all the time. And I'm just like, man, don't rain on my parade. I'm enjoying it. You know, it's like, Tenzin is one of the best characters. He's up there with Iroh, you know, in terms of awesomeness. So, whatever. Let's just blow up this thingy over here. Oh, we have the other thing that we can blow up too in the, um... That one, yeah. Come over here so I can just... Okay, stop. Stop, there we go. Is he gonna blow up the other guy too? That'd be kinda awesome. Nope. Okay. What is this now? Is it a new room? Flooded caves. Well, I don't think I can go in here. Oh, this is where we were! Huh. Well. We kinda sequence broke our way through there. That was cool. And let us go grab that one Jinjo that we need to blow up to get. If I can find him. Chances are I won't, but hey. It's the effort that matters. I'm trying to sound all deep and philosophical and just trying to hide the fact that I can't speak as loud as I can because of where I am right now, which is home with the family. So, hey. It works sometimes, I think. Do I sound deep and philosophical, or do I just sound like I'm trying to keep my voice down? Because the latter is true. But is the step ladder true? See, that's just me sounding needlessly philosophical, which is fun. But at the same time, I could see how it's annoying. Yeah, I have no idea where that one switch was. Actually, I sort of do. It was up in a cornery type area. Like, it felt like the corner, the end of a map, if you will. So, he does move a lot faster if you jump, which is actually a lot of fun. Sort of like, sort of feels like Scrooge McDuck's pogo jumping. You know? I think it's in that back corner over there. Don't go into the water, because we can't jump that high in water. We can jump past all these dudes, though. It was over here, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, that was it. And fall down into this air. Fall, fall. There we go. Kind of hard when your movement is jumping. But hey. 
I'll help you, just wait. Neon green Jinjo. You're new. Let's get rid of this cowboy dude. Or not get rid of- Okay, we're gonna get rid of it. Oh, no. No, we're not. That's cool. Oh, we already got one of you. Okay, I just, I guess I didn't take note of the fact that you look like a highlighter factory. Can we... Can, can we can we get, get get out get through the door, get get through the banjo ba banjo there there. That was harder than it should have been. When doors are an issue, then you know there's something wrong with the controls. Well, not really. I mean, I am a pogo stick. That is my existence. I am physically a pogo stick. Oh, please tell me we can get up there. Yes, thank goodness. Because I was going to say, I don't want to go all the way. No, no! I didn't say to blow up. I wanted to warp! Oh, uh, wigwam, yes. Don't flim flam the wigwam. Don't even know where I'm going with that, but hey. We're back to Baron Bird. Hum. You know, I think... How many did we get in this world? Let me see here. Seven? Did we actually get seven out of the ten? Are you serious? Well... I don't know if there's any... Other real... Okay. I'll take a seven. If you guys could maybe just hint towards a place to go next, I'd totally be down with that. But I guess for now, let's move on to the next world. Just go see. A preview, if you will. You know, a quick look. Actually, we should probably go back to... What's-his-face? Jiggy Wiggy. That is his name. Just so that we can get the next world after that, maybe. We'll have to see. I'm not sure. I think it was 15, and we have 15. So let's go back to the Wooded Hollow. Which is both wooded and hollow. So, it is semi... What? I don't even know where I'm going with that. For oh, no, I need 17. Wait, no, I have 17 and need 14. I see. Haha, -ha. so I am here at a good time. And all right, bro. It is weird that in the first areas of the game, it does seem to be a lot slower. And then in the actual levels, it's usually not that bad. All right, we have to go up here, don't we? No, how do we... Do we just go? Do we just... Do I just... How to talk? Yes. Okay, so yeah, we just... We do have it unlocked already, which is awesome. Coolio beans! Apparently I was doing it wrong, and it's not to be off the edges, but you're just supposed to look at the, the what it is. However, I know that that's a top corner. And I know that that is a bottom piece, and it looks like it goes right there. Or it could go right there. And, uh, that's a top. It looks about right there. Nope, nope, I've been wrong before. Then it goes right here. There we go. This definitely goes right there. This one... goes... Uh... No. Right there, yes. What? What? Are you... There we go. Okay. This one goes right there for sure. What? There? No, what? It has to be. There's the thingies. I'm... Refusing. Okay, sure. I am not good. Stop that. Ugh. Okay, no, that one clearly goes right there. Maybe just trying it over and over and do, like, I should guess no that if I do it over and over. This one's clearly a... That one has a top. Okay. See? That wasn't so bad. You have completed Jiggy Wiggy's challenge for, so now the Great One will show you the way. To where? Where is next? After... After... 
the world that I still haven't done yet, which is the one that I'm checking before this one now. Behold the power of the mighty J- Okay, yeah, we, we've heard this. As I can see the whole thing of the, the needless cutscenes. Uh, cliff top. Okay, so that's the obviously the area after this one. And there... To where? I didn't see where that said. Well, we know that that's the next level, though, so... The giant sign telling us is nice. Plus the golden statue, so... It's good that we have both. Cool. I realize that. So, I'm gonna head out, check out the next world, which we'll probably do next time, but I think I'll walk there and finish up my conversation. Oh, wait, what? Why is it locked? Oh, I probably need the need the 20 now to even get in. Which makes sense. That's that's an easy way of seeing, you know, without actually having to be. So let's head to Pine Grove, where everything will probably be very piney with a hint of groveiness. Cool. What is this giant sign? I didn't even look at it. The Log Flume of Doom. It's out of order. Darn it. I love Log fume Flumes. It was so good in uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon. That was another game I really s sort of felt like wanting to Let's Play, but realized that it would probably be boring. Oh, hey, there's a Wigwam. Can we... Oh, right. I saw the Globo in that one cutscene. So, what do these signs say? I want to check it out. First off, let's kill this guy. Probably the last of his species. It's cool. Management accepts no responsibility for the thieving pickpockets that it employs within Witchy World. Oh, Witchy World. Is that the next one? Anyone who rides all the quality attractions and survives is entitled to join the Witchy World fan club. Current member is zero. Wow, dark humor. Can, can we, can we re read, read the final sign? Witchy World theme park is currently closed due to an appalling safety record. Once the authorities have been bribed, we will reopen. I love it. Alright guys, next time I guess we're going into Witchy World. See ya.